testing the myth that certain types of footwear can inhibit your driving to the point where they make it dangerous. We've done some controls, and we've selected the three types of footwear we consider most likely to cause that difficulty. And now it's time to put this story to the test. It's why we're wearing our driving shoes. This is just wrong. <laughs> Seriously, this could be dangerous, so stop laughing. Seriously, stop laughing. Yeah. Tully? Yeah. All right. These red heels were the third slowest performers in the reaction time tests. I'm glad. Oh, hey. Humans weren't meant to wear these things. But when the rubber hits the road, how will these shoes affect Adam's 117 benchmark? We've done some weird stuff on this show over the years. But being in a sports car strapped in with a four-point harness wearing red high-heeled shoes feels like the strangest thing we've ever done. And if it ready, feels Adam. strange... I'm ready. Let's test these red shoes. Let's see how strange he drives. OK, red shoes in three, two, one, go. <laughs> Unfortunately for Adam, there seems to be trouble from the very start. Harder to get up to speed because I'm pointing my toes. Because of the narrow toe. <laughs> Whoa. OK, that was different. And the towering heel. Into the reverse 180, ladies and gentlemen. Shifting from pedal to pedal seems harder. Whoa, there's a little understeer there, eh? But Adam and his stilettos do stay the distance. Come on, baby. Let's get home. Daddy's got a new pair of shoes. And he completes the lap. Yeah! But how much have high heels hampered his handling? How did I do? I don't know. What do you think? I feel like, if anything, I was a couple seconds slow. Nope, you were right on the money, 117. No way! Yep. Adam has matched his control time exactly. One minute, 17. <laughs> Freaking hell, that's hilarious. In red, four-inch high heels. Ah, nothing like a good pair of driving shoes. But will there be a spike All right. in Jamie's lap time? You know, I might have a problem doing this if I was more insecure than I am. As it is, it's just another day on the job. Don't miss an all-new Mythbusters Sunday at 9, only on Discovery.